European leaders have agreed to set up a vast recovery fund to help cushion the economic blow of the COVID-19 pandemic. The fund may be worth more than a trillion euros, but there are questions about where the money will come from or whether member states will have to repay it. Our correspondent Jack Parrick reports for us from Brussels. The start of a plan forming to find euros. We are not talking about billion, we are talking about trillion. After four and a half hours of video conference, EU leaders who've been battling on how to shoulder debt collectively have agreed to work towards a so-called recovery fund. This fund should be of a sufficient magnitude targeted towards the sectors and geographical parts of Europe most affected and be dedicated to dealing with this unprecedented crisis. The leaders have agreed to anchor this fund in the seven-year EU budget from the start of 2021, something they were thrashing out prior to the coronavirus outbreak. The Netherlands has been reluctant to take on debt collectively, but appears to be on board to work on the plan for the fund. The European Commission, now tasked with writing up a proposal, is already preparing for the fights between countries over whether the fund should issue repayable loans or some kind of grant. There will certainly be a sound balance between grants and loans, and this is a matter of uh, to negotiation. Crucially, Europe's economic powerhouse, Germany, says it's prepared to pay more into the EU pot for the fund. It's also supported by Italy and Spain, who were insisting on taking on collective debt. Leaders will reconvene in two weeks' time to continue negotiations. Jack Parrick, Euronews, Brussels.